guys, welcome back to another season. So we're going to be playing Going Medieval. Uh, it's early access, so there'll probably be some bugs once in a while, but uh, from past experience, it hasn't been a totally horrible game with the bugs that have been in the game. So I think it's stable enough where we can actually play it and record a season. Um, comparison to basically like Prison Architect or City Skylines, I would say it's way more stable. Um, the developers do a really good job at making sure that uh, is consistent. So let's create a new game and we're gonna go with our standard. I don't wanna do survival because that gets like way too hard, but uh, we will have our difficulty on normal. So uh, I'm pretty experienced with the game, so we can go ahead and do that. And then we're going to go with a a lone wolf uh, that one's a little bit difficulter than a new life or the other one so we can go ahead and get all those resources but we also it's a lot less than what we get from this one so there's a lot more stuff so and it's also during the winter rather than the spring so it's going to be a little bit more challenging and we can go ahead and just generate a random random map I didn't realize that there was a dice sound to that Okay, so what I want is basically like a hillside one that gives us a little bit more resources for different things and stuff like that. I also want a large map. I don't know if that's going to make a huge difference. <laughs> I guess not. Okay, so we can go ahead and I'll leave my banner the way it is. Uh, we should probably give this um, a name. So uh, we can't name it after this. So I should probably make sure that it's like something really good. So maybe kingdom of trees that will do good all right so moving on we can select our character i actually have a character already set we can load one and we'll just call them uh trees or we can go north and then select trees so his stats on the side here are basically um mostly Animal hundred <laughs> I can't even speak today. It's a little bit early in the morning. Um, basically farming and uh, culinary, so cooking. Uh, he has some skills in construction and intelligence, which is good for research. We are good with marksmen as well, and we have a little bit of medicine. Those are like primary things to get started with. And then we have some other stats, mainly um, melee um smithing and actually you know what we should probably change the smithing to mining that's probably more important and uh tailoring
alrighty then. So I got a basic shelter built. Um, it's not much. It's still something though. Uh, we got basically like a little kitchen area. I'm trying to get down to the uh, area. We still need a floor in the kitchen, but uh, we got some raw meat um, on the floor here. Some tallow which is basically fat so it could be used for medicine and stuff like that which is really important we also got some food here for us to basically eat so that will give us a little bit more um food because i think the wolf that's been around here ate our <laughs> remaining food so which is kind of unfortunate i didn't have the house built fast enough and they kind of just wandered in so uh but we did chop up a deer i, I, I want to see if we can't find um there's a fox there i want to see if we can't find some other animals that we can get so there's one up on this hill i don't know if there's a way up on that hill yeah, there's a way up on that hill. So what we'll do is we'll go ahead and collect that. We'll get as much um, as we can. So we have some food during the winter, right? Okay, what's that? That is dirt, I think. Oh, another deer. Good. We'll tell him to haul that in. Okay, so... Oh, there's actually quite a few deer around here. That's good. Um, oh, those are really important. The uh, herbs. We'll tell them to harvest those. Those are good for medicine as well. And I think that's about it. Yeah, I'm not seeing any other deer that we can basically pick up. All right, that's good. Uh, we can fast forward through the night. That'll be good. Oh, there's another deer over here. Tell him to pick that up in a little bit. I don't know where the base is. <laughs> it's somewhere around here. Now, I think this um, might be their experimentation with rivers. I don't know. Like, I noticed that some of these older ones have, like, these long uh, kind of caverns that go through here. So I'm almost wondering if that's going to be like rivers and stuff that they're going to be implementing. I really do need to find where our base is located. Maybe if I click on there. There we go. That's better. <laughs> All right. So yeah, it's basically plan one is to get the base up and running and at least have a kitchen set up. Um, maybe start working on cold storage, uh, which allows us to store things a little bit better than, you know, long term. Uh
All right, so currently I'm working on cold storage. Uh, we're down in a small area underneath the house, uh, which is pretty deep. Uh, we have all this room. I went three, three down just to make sure that we had enough room for uh, this area over here if we went and decided to go under. So we should have plenty of space to expand to when we need to. <clears throat> So that's at least the goal. He's just clearing out an area and then we'll put down some cheap material. Um, reason why we're not putting like planks down is because there's insulation. <clears throat> if we click on some of these, we can see the um, thermal insulation. We don't want that in cold so storage generally. So um, what we can use is sticks. We have plenty of sticks laying around out here that we can make use of. So we'll probably end up doing that. And then we can store our meats, our perishables and stuff like that down there. Uh, I created two wings, one for raw food, cooked food, and then we have um, one for uh, resources that are other than that, that might perish like uh, leather, for example. Um, that's been inside all the time, but it's been going down with the, um, well, I thought it said it would, was going down. Maybe it was because the windows were open, I'm not sure. It says decomposes never, but I don't know. We'll put it in cold storage anyways. And there was tallow, tallow, it's not de decompiling. Saplings, things like that, those will decompile eventually. Probably want to store those as well. So, things like that, you know, we'll put down there. Um, that shouldn't be out there for some reason, but it is. That's interesting. Our herbs will have to be down there as well. Should probably uh, see how the progress is going. And we want to put a door between here. Uh, that's why I've left a kind of one block gap right on these two so we can separate them the smaller the area the um, Better the temperature so you can build doors. Those are fine, but kind of necessary for cold storage So once he gets that all done, then we can move on to um, putting some sticks down here for uh, Stick floor that should do just fine Tell him to clear out the area first though Okay. <clears throat> Just about done. Alright guys, so we got quite a bit of stuff done today. Um, 
I'm pretty happy with the progress. Uh, we got a small house built and we got some storage outside. We'll basically eventually uh, like expand the place. This is just like a starter place for us to actually survive in through the winter and then we'll start working on something a little bit bigger. Uh, we also got uh, a room basically set up. We got a cold cellar for our food so our food can last longer. This can last like one year so that's really good. Uh, that's only 11 days so hopefully we can make use of that pretty soon but the meat's gonna last like a year so that's good. Um, this is our cooked food is like 43 days so I'm pretty happy with our cold cellar. He still has a little bit of work to do on the uh, cold cellar but um, outside of that it shouldn't take too too much time to finish that project and then we can start putting some of our herbs if they survive that long um, out in, from out there and put our seeds and stuff like that down there um, any barley that we have left uh, I did buy some um, because we're gonna need that for the spring and stuff but um, outside of that if you are new to my channel don't forget to subscribe comment down below rate the video and I will see you guys next time Thanks for watching. Peace out.